Hey, what's up, YouTube land? It's your boy, Eddie Hill, the Pennsylvania Toy Collector. And I'm back for a new review week. And it's time for another Eddie Hill review, the White Oak Toy Collector. It's time for another Eddie Hill review. It's review time. People! And today, we'll be reviewing Legends. Dollar General Legends Ultra Magnus, which is just a repaint of the Optimus Prime mold, which I do have. But yeah, I've wanted to do this for a long time, since I've been looking for this for a very long time. So glad I finally found my Ultra Magnus Little Legends Optimus Prime mold Ultra Magnus, which is nice. And it rolls very good. But now we're going to get down to vehicle mode comparison. Here he is next to the Generations Ultra Magnus. And they are almost similar, but not completely. But given they're both repaints of Optimus Prime, it looks good, if I do say so myself. But now we're going to get down to Transformation, which is simple but easy with these Legends Transformers. First, we're going to disconnect the arms, like so. Fold up the head. Fold down the legs. Rotate the waist to reveal the waist. And there we got Ultra Magnus Prime in his robot mode. And he looks pretty cool, if I do say so myself. I do love the blue assets on this old school figure. It looks very nice, especially for a repaint. And I do own quite a few repaints, if you know what I mean. But now we're going to compare him next to Universe Classics Magnus, which I'm transforming him off camera because I've memorized his whole transformation. I am just really that good at transformations here on my channel. If I've had it for a long time and I've memorized the entire transformation by heart, believe me, it's easy peasy, lemon greasy, as the saying goes. But it's a fun figure, especially for a Dollar General figure. Would I recommend this little Ultra Magnus to anyone collecting Ultra Magnuses? Yes, if you can find him for a good price, he is worth adding to your Transformers collection. Even as a repaint of Optimus Prime, if you know what I mean. And I just love some repaints from now and then. But here is Legends Magnus next to... Generations Ultra Magnus. Sorry if I pause there, I really... Really can't help that, and my autism literally pauses for a second. With my mental disability, I get pausing in my head sometimes. But this is a good-looking Ultra Magnus, and so is this. Would I recommend these if you're a Transformers fan and love Ultra Magnus? Yes, they are worth picking up. Especially if you love Ultra Magnus without the armor. I'd say, worth your money. And that's all there is to say for this review. And if you like this video, make sure to like, make sure to comment, and don't forget to subscribe for more videos like this. And I did enjoy making this video for you. For my YouTube fans here on Eddie Hill's Reviews, that's Eddie Hill. Moving on and rock on and rock out, YouTube land.